So next would be RoboRock S8 Max V Ultra, which is an AI robot vacuum. And of course, it's not just a vacuum. It's AI recognizes and avoids obstacles, you know, th things like pets, yourself, your shoes, uh, tangled cords, and learns the best clean cleaning routes for your home, delivering real autonomous cleaning with voice controlled precision. So if you've ever used a Roomba, uh, obviously the limitations there, I think some of them are, are basically touting it as being AI, uh, AI powered, but it runs around the room in some sort of a random pattern. And as it, as it runs in obstacles, it'll react to running into those obstacles. So even though it's a robot, the capabilities of it were, were pretty primitive. And so with this vacuum, we're able to take AI and take the vacuum experience, if there is one, to the next level because it's able to learn about a room where it needs to go, how it's going to clean the room, and then run into fewer things and the ability to run around different obstacles, which obviously are going to be in the way of you having a very clean rug. So next gadget would be Time Kettle X1 AI Interpreter Hub. So this is a powerhouse for people who travel. This device provides near instant accurate translation for over 40 languages and works offline, breaking down language barriers for businesses and adventure. So one of the things that I get stressed out when I travel to another country um, is the use of the English language. I don't you know, learn the, the native language in the companies, countries I'm going to. So you're hoping you're going to run into somebody who speaks English. And sometimes that's possible and sometimes that's not.